Hello everyone, welcome back once again to Career Q, a place to curate your career. In today's video, I am going to talk about this uh, viral video that I watched on TikTok and I thought that this is absolutely important for me to talk with my audience because I want everyone to be aware how and why these big tech companies are creating layoffs and uh, you know, um, so many layoffs are being heard about. So when we, whenever we hear about layoffs, we think that, you know, this, some project might have stopped or maybe some acquisition might have failed, but there are several other aspects to it out of which this is one aspect and probably one of the major aspects that is being done or that is being performed by these major big tech giants that we know. So yeah, that is the topic of discussion today. And uh, it, it is actually a very shocking thing that I've come to know. And I really want to talk to you all of you about it for you to get a clear picture of, you know, what is happening and why is this thing happening with you or, you know, around you and such that you are able to take a well-informed decision if ever you come, uh, you know, God forbid, but if ever you come in, uh, in these kind of similar situations, you are able to take a well-informed decision. So that is the topic of discussion in today's video. And if you're new to the channel and have not yet subscribed, then I am Shagufta. I talk all about uh, the tech sector, software sector and the different organizations within the tech sector, uh, all the different technologies that uh, uh, we work upon on the, in the tech sector. And without a further ado, let's get started with the video. So before coming to the actual situation, let's go in the past and know what happened. When in the year 2021, 2022, when, you know, the great resignation and all of those things were in picture, these employers, firstly, they started a lot of R&D projects and they, they overhired people. That is something that they did. But secondly, in order to, you know, gain all those good uh, experienced employees, in order to take the employees from their competitors, these organizations started to uh, hire these employees at a greater uh, salary range. OK, so uh, say, for example, if an average salary for a software engineer uh, with five years of work experience was around 10 to 12 LPA. These employers started giving 15, 18 or even 20 LPA. There are people who have also got over 20 LPA within a span of, you know, the five years of experience, work experience. So that is how much these employers had given at that time, uh, you know, when they had hired these employees. But now since a uh, recession has hit in and times have changed, now these employers or these organizations are facing the issue of, you know, overpriced employees within their organization. Now, these employees are just five years, six years of experience and they are, uh, these employers are paying them a hefty amount of 20 to 25 LPA, which has also shifted the range. You know, if you today, if you search on the internet, how much an employee uh, with six, seven years, five, six years of experience get, the average salary range has jumped. So say, for example, before this entire pandemic thing had happened, before that, uh, the average salary of an employee having five years of experience was 15 LPA. This range from 15 has gone as high as 20 LPA. Now, what are these people doing? These tech giants, they are actually aiming for such mid-level engineers or mid-level employees who have been hired at a high price. They are being removed or laid off from these organizations at, uh, you know, because they are they are being paid so much. They have to pay those employees so much, which is why they have, you know, reduced or released those employees. And again, they have created vacancies for these job positions, same job role, same job description. They have again high, uh, opened a hiring for this particular job position in this particular job project with the previous range of 15 LP or maybe 16 LPA. So here is what they are doing. They are actually reducing. So how much? Four to five LPA they were able to reduce. So this is what the, these big tech giants are doing these days. All of the layoffs are not, uh, you know, because of that this thing has become obsolete because this thing can be done by AI now. This is automated. No, it is not because of that. The strategy that they are taking up, this is called the great reboot in which they are rebooting or they are bringing the salary slab for that particular range in the previous zone or maybe something, at least something lesser than the current, uh, you know, whatever range it is in. So that is what these employers are actually aiming for. You must have seen a, a lot of cases in which, you know, uh, people said that, you know, I was fired and then I was asked to rejoin the company uh, at a reduced pay. Yes, people uh, have claimed this. They have written it on X. They have written it on LinkedIn. All of this is only being done because they want to reduce that range from, you know, whatever the current range is for whatever uh, number of years of experience. They want to bring it back to the original or maybe a little amount of increase and not as much as that they had given during this pandemic season. This is actually a strategy that majorly all of these big tech giants are doing, including the service based, including the project based companies. So, yes, if you are somebody who is having uh, a job offer at 
uh, a certain position with a very high uh, you know incentive they are they are offering you a very high salary then be aware it might be a, a trap or it might cause you a lot of mental agony because you know these are the tips the tricks that these employers are doing just to get their way and just to uh, tell the employees that they are the ones who still have the power uh, if you are god forbid uh, but if you are somebody who has um, you know been laid off and you somehow again see that particular job description that particular role uh, which you were doing then try to reach out to your hr your manager over linkedin or anywhere try to reach them and tell them that you are willing to join at a lower pay you are willing to take in whatever they are uh, you know giving because because you know this is something that all of them are doing in uh, togetherness okay so it is a strategy that these tech people that the the hrs the tech giants are taking so you know it is not that today uh, some you were released by some organization tomorrow some other organization will be willing to pay you the same amount no they will not be willing to pay you the same amount even if uh, say for example you are not taken in within the same organization you go to a competitor organization go with whatever range they are asking you don't take it as no i was working with 25 lpa how can i go down to 20 lpa or 18 lpa i cannot do that that's a uh, you know going down that is what they are doing to the market and that is what they want to establish so you know in the end you will have to join uh, in that range because that is the range that they uh, want to set once again now this video went uh, viral and there were several several employers there were several hrs who agreed who wrote that yes uh, it is exactly the same thing that you know the companies are trying to do so it's just a heads up that this can happen and that reason might not be the same that you know this thing has become obsolete this technology has become obsolete this that the reason can actually be about the great reboot so yeah that's all that i have for you in today's video do tell me in the comment section what you think about these employers and uh, whether you have seen anybody face this situation whether you yourself have faced this situation put all the comments down in uh, the comment section if there is anything else that you want me to cover in my videos put them down as well and yeah or uh, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you have not done that already i'll come again tomorrow with another new video till then stay tuned to career q thanks for watching take care bye